Yo, dude, I heard your stomach grumbling all throughout that final we just took. Yeah, no, I, I was starving at a really small breakfast, but it's a good thing I brought lunch today. What'd you bring to eat? Well, actually, today I have my meal ready to eat, menu number nine, which is from the Department of Defense, which is basically like, you know, something that you bring on the road so that you can have when you're on the field, like the army, you know, you can just crack this bad boy open. It's like 2,000 calories for the whole day. You're set. So today I'm going to set it open. I'm going to show you guys how. So as I said before, the meal ready to eat is like for the military because, you know, when they're on the field, they just want something really quick they can set up and something light. So when I'm in Boy Scouts, we use some of these when we're doing a long backpacking trip just so we can reduce our load on the back. And uh, it's like a full meal ready in five minutes. So I'm going to unbox it for you now. And uh, you guys are gonna see why these things are so great when they're given out in surplus. All right, let's see what we got first. Oh wow, wow. We have some honey mustard and onion, onion pretzel nuggets. Nuggets. We have peanut butter. I'm assuming these are crackers. Yeah, snack bread. Snack bread. Raisin mix with nuts. They got some hot sauce, some mints, it's napkins. Oh, yeah, like salt. One bite. Oh no. This is our heating pack. I'll show you guys what that does in a second. It heats up, actually, surprise. This is a spoon so I can actually eat. Strawberry jam. Ooh. This is a chocolate milkshake, believe it or not. This is what's in an MRE. So this is a little more information. It's 1,250 cal kilocalories, so it's quite a bit. It's kind of tasty as well. And here's the main course, which for this was Beef stew. Ask. What's your question? 1,200 kilocalories? No, no. 150 kilocalories. No, no, a calorie like a with the capital C is a kilocalorie. So our normal calories, oh, when we say calories, right, right. it's a calorie. Right. All right, he got, he got like, he was like, big. what the fuck? No. <laughs> what, what? what the heck? <laughs> I thought the bag was chips. <laughs> I thought it was gas. It should be full of chips or some shit. Yeah, no. All right. <laughs> all right. Guys, keep it PG. Oh, all right. Oh, you're still recording. <laughs> so, <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> um, It's been like a year since I've done this but I think I remember how to do it. So I'm gonna tear off the top of this so I can actually insert my food in here. Oh. Classic. And how long does it take to heat up? Well, you see, as long as you prefer, but uh, I usually put it in for about a minute or so just so it gets like pretty warm, but I don't scald my tongue when I you know, insert the food into my uh, orbicularis oris. I see, I see. Yes. So I'm gonna tear off the top of the bag, place the emery in pouch, or pouch in bag with what heater. Is that the beef stew? It is. Yep, it says right there, beef stew. And these things expire like in a hundred years. Like you're gonna be set when you have some of this. Okay, let's do 101. Yeah. <laughs> use this pizza box as the leverage that I'll need. So leverage. I'm going to fold on top of here and insert it back into the box. Just so it stays together. It's kind of like origami, you know, you have to fold these little slots real nice like a hot pocket Ow. you guys have ever had that <laughs> all right I'm going to if the heater should be underneath so I'll fold that over um, and I'll fill this up in a second and then I'll fold it okay so now for the fun part is this what's gonna make it steam up yes so, I'll try to not overfill between those few lines. Good. A little more. And then I'll close this off. Spread it around down there. Put it back in its nice little home. Firmly grasp it. And then tuck it in nicely. And leave it there just like this so the water still gets a chance to activate all the heaters. And I'll be able to enjoy my food very quickly. So we've left us here know. for about a minute now, and if you feel under here, it's really hot. Uh, Stefan actually called out with quite pain, um, intense pain, how hot it was. He was like, whoa, whoa. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna leave this here for a little while longer so the heat gets a chance to fully, you know, move throughout this package. And uh, as you can see on the inside, it's getting a little foggy because of all the steam being released. So we'll check back after I open up some of the other packages and we continue eating. So here we have a delicious peanut butter and jelly open sandwich um, just because they only gave me one piece of bread but um, Arib can even testify this stuff tastes pretty good. 
It's pretty yeah. all right. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, so I'll good. be eating that soon. Uh, this boy is pretty much done. That's still really hot and now it's hot on top as well. So uh, the heat is dispersed throughout the package and I can finally eat a nice warm meal. I've got a Stefano shaking up my uh, cocoa cuisine. And then I'm gonna take this bad boy out and that'll be the next thing you guys see. But I'll have Jaden or Philip open up these pretzel nuggets. See how they like those. Hey, is this why I record? Yeah, he's recording. Ready? I'm already recording. All right. So, we finally finished my beef stew cooking, and let's open this bad boy up. Careful. Oh, yes. Oh, my. All right. You see? So, I don't know. It smells nice. Yeah, it does, actually. I see. The taste is in the smell. Yeah. <laughs> Here? Actually, that looks pretty good. Yeah. And so it'll be nice and warm for my empty tummy that was so loud during the calculus exam. And uh, here, if any of you guys want to try these pretzel nuggets? Oh. I thought of chicken nuggets when you said these. They're pretty nice. So, and after all this, I can down my very nice beverage powder. And they have a lemonade in here. They've got some mints to clean my breath. And of course, napkins so because last... we're clean. Last thing the scout is clean. Is so, soldiers thinking your breast thank you for watching, and I hope you now are more educated on the meal ready to eat menu number nine. Maybe in the future, you may see one of these and you'll know exactly how to use them. So, thank you for this, watching this video, and I'll see you next time. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. The